We are off late seeing steep rise in youngster coming with heart problem and mainly those who are coming with acute heart attack. 25% of our patients were around the age of 30 to 40. Today morning around 5 am I did an angioplasty of a 26 year guy. In last two months we had six patients who were in their 20s and 30s who came with not only heart attack but they came with cardiac arrest meaning thereby the chances of their going home alive was less than 30 percent so right now we are doing around two lakh surgeries per year and our health burden in terms of coronary artery disease or heart attack is around 30 million so there is a lot of big gap in between all this disease the the coronary problem that we say is a lifestyle related disorders. Almost 60% of them, when we do their blood sugar in emergency, then uh, we see that the blood sugar, they never knew that they are diabetic. I think everybody is uh, going to gym and doing gym, but uh, physically, otherwise, in day to day, we are inactive. And then in metro cities, the stress of the work, less rest, and absolute sedentary lifestyle. Classical with chest pain, sudden breathlessness, cold sweating kind of a thing, sudden episode of palpitation, something which is often, often overlooked. It's like you have some kind of upper abdominal discomfort. I have gas and I have a little bit of gas in my chest. I take a gas drink, but they don't want to show to the cardiologist because they have the opinion that the cardiologist will go and he'll do the angiogram and he'll put a stent and they just want to avoid stent. If it is an unusual kind of acidity persisting for very long, then immediate ECG should be done. My suggestion is go to the cardiologist, know your risk and if, if you are at risk, get your treatment done as early as possible. Because the subtle heart attacks can be missed by even a general practitioner. Most important, exercise. At least have 45 minutes brisk walk minimum at a stretch. Be active in day-to-day -day life. Even in your work, walking from one floor to the other or climbing, don't use lift. Second thing is a balanced diet. Additional sugar in food should not be taken. Salt intake should be minimum. You must be sort of avoiding too much of fat, fried things, junk things. So healthy food. The third is smoking. Don't smoke at all. Avoid secondhand smoke also. And get away from stress. Sleep is also very important. You must, the body must rest also. Have some de-stressing activity also. Take care of if you have hypertension, if you have diabetes. Make sure that you properly take care of your these ailments. वो एक पंजाबी में कहावत है कि अगर आप दिल खोला अगर खोलने दे नहीं हो यारा नाल तो फिर दिल खोलेगा उजारा नाल. So let's pledge today to quit smoking, count your calories, control your diabetes, control your blood pressure, keep your heart healthy and live in a healthy heart environment. Lead a healthy lifestyle so that you don't get heart problem at prime of your life. Keep your heart happy and keep your heart healthy.